tun tsayar da wa'adin mulkin rukun kwariya a jamhuriyar ta Niger na ci gaba da haifar da mahawara tare da raba kawunan yan kasar wannan ya biyo bayan jan kafan da ake ganin sojojin da suka kifar da gwamnatin Muhammad Bazum ke yi wajen gabatar da jadawalin dawo da kasar kan ta farkin demokradiya to tun da masu iya magana kan ce da dan gari ne akan ci gari ga Muhammad Tijani Hassan da ya duba mana wannan batu ka kuma karin bayanin da ya mana a kwana a tashi watanni shida kenan da sojoji suka karba madafun iko a jamhuriyar Niger bayan sun kifar da halistacciyar gwamnatin farar hula ta Muhammad Bazum wata al'umar kasar suka zaba sai dai bayan share wannan dogon lokaci cikin dambarwa da kikikaka har kawo yanzu babu wasu alamu a game da wa'adin da sojojin suka dibar wa kansu domin dawo da mulki ga farar hula duk wanda matsin lamba daga kungiyar haba ka tattalin arzikin kasashen yammacin Afirka ECOWAS ko kuma sai da yawo dake da awar a dawo da kasar kan ta farkin demokradiya cikin gajeren lokaci a cikin wannan yanayi ne wasu shugabannin al'umma ciki har da sarakunan gargajiya suka yi kira ga majalisar sojojin karkashin brigadiya janar abdurrahman tani da ta dauki iya lokacin da take gani ya dace domin sai ta kasar don kada a koma gidan jiya Muhammadu Bashir Haruna Hambali sarkin karamar hukumar Jinju dake yankin dosu na daga cikin masu irin wannan tunani va a kornu rami ne alakas da depa yace gaggauta mika mulki ga farar hula zai sake dawo da mu gidan jiya don haka ina ganin ya dace a dauki lokaci mai tsawo domin muna da kalubale da dama a gaban mu wadanda yan siyasa ba za su iya magance su ba musamman ma batu na tsaro ina ga zai fi kyau a baiwa wadannan sojoji wa'adi na shekaru uku kuma wannan hukunci na a hannun yan kasa ba wai a hannun kungiyar ECOWAS ko kuma wani daga can waje ba to sai dai yan Niger da dama musamman masu fafutkar kare demokradiya na adawa da ra'ayin wannan basara ke suna masu cewa hakan tamkar mayar da hannun agogo baya ne a game da ta farkin demokradiya da aka yi nasarar dora kasar akai bayan gogor maya ta shekaru masu yawa Alhasan Intinikar dan siyasa kuma makusancin hambararren shugaba Muhammad Bazum na mai tunanin cewa kada rukun kwariyar da sojoji za su ya wuce na shekara guda kafin su tattara su fice makalite de democrat je souhaite une transition de courte durée yace a matsayi na nawan da yayi na'am da demokradiya ina fatan ganin an gajarce wa'adin mulkin rukun kwariya kada ya wuce watanni shida tsananan yayi gudu shekara guda domin a yanayin da ake ciki mafita ga kasar mu shine dawo da ita kan ta farkin demokradiya l'intérêt supérieur de notre nation c'est le retour à l'ordre constitutionnel tun dai lokacin da ya jawabin sa na farko bayan juyin mulki inda ya sanar da aniyar sa ta jarraga mar kasar na wa'adin da ba zai wuce shekaru uku ba har kawo yanzu shugaban gwamnatin mulkin sojan janar abdurrahman tani bai kara sake waiwayo wannan batu ba to amma yan fafutka irin su Sulai Umaru na kungiyar Forum Citoyen Purla Republic sun ce sun yi imanin cewa sojojin ba za su mika wuya ga masu hura musu kunnuwa ba on constate uh, une certaine opinion de nigerien ki cherche yace da akwai wadansu tsararun mutane da ke san dora sojojin da suka yi juyin mulki akan keken bera to amma ina tunanin cewa janar abdurrahman tani ya mallaki hankali da basirar fahimtar cewa a wannan karni yan nijar ba sa bukatar mulkin sojin na shekaru masu yawa don haka ina da yakinin cewa ya san abin da ya kawo shi kuma zai gama ya tafi ila in mission et cette mission il doit la complir et s'en aller a halin yanzu dai yan nijar sun saka ido suna ji babban taron kasa da za a shirya nan gaba domin ka'ide lokacin da sojoji za su share akan madafun iko to amma a shafukan sa da zumunta mahawara na zafafa a game da zakulo wakilan da ya tantance su halarci taron sannan kuma ga sharadin ECOWAS na kin amincewa da mulkin rukun kwariya na sai Mahadi ka ture an gaishe ka Muhammad Tijani Hassan kuma karshen jigon rahotanni mu na wannan yammaci kenan Kungiyar inganta rayuwar al'umma da kananan yara ta Afirka AMG a takarce kuma a turanci ta lashi takobin kakkabe jahilci tsakanin yara kanana da matasa a wannan nahiya Kungiyar dai ta yi amfani da wani taro da ta gudanar a Lagos waje nuna cewa nan da shekara ta 233 za ta ilmantar da yara sama da miliyan 120 a fadin Afirka baki daya ga dai wakilin mu na Lagos Mansur Balabello dauke da karin bayani Bincike dai ya nuna cewa a nahiyar Afirka musamman a Loko da Sako aka riski yara kanana masu tarin yawa ba tare da zuwa makaranta ba Shugabar wannan kungiya ta Afirka Mission Global Pasto Polu Adeboye ta bayyana makasudin wannan taro na wannan lokaci a Bunnan Lagos 
For our education programs, schools have been built in some of the remotest parts of Africa for children. Tenachua Murad Munechewa Yara Supara Karo de Ukarumu na Ilmantadusu in the Ayanzaka Mungina Makarantu Ak Awikan Kazashan Aprika. Dumi Ilmanta de Yaran de Kate Tele de Telochi na Yansu. Had no access to education at all. Madam Brown yetunde there the gatchin jigo na wanam kunja tache yung kulum matasash gatchin kazashan to rei. Sebili de neman aiki kota lankaka baba tune de za azuba idu ba awana loka chind aikechki. Every day we still see our brothers and sisters striking across the Sahara, going on banana boats in the Mediterranean. Yungurishiga na ye ture teke te te kung bar malia emu yakas and jebala zana a ko wana lokachi. When the dola do kimataiki na patakar de ara senu makamar aiki. In the Kowaze Dogara de Kansa, Tal de Rungumar Al Adumu Nagaragajia, Namutinchi Debun Nagaba. That value that makes you value yourself as an African child. To say the Achewar Ambassador Nguinger UNICEF, Dr. Hajjo Sani, Alu Baleta Mika, Gamas Ilum, Pasaha de Kimia, and Ayer Bakida. It is imperative to acknowledge that technology alone is not a punishment. Tena che wa sani ilimu mpasaha taale ilimu nsader wa shine eti lu. Mze ilimu ntada ya la burni de kawe anayera aprika. Tede dunia zaata kasanche ata apanghanu kamaliada ake ikirari. Address connectivity and issue of digital divide. Taale bayi ya la mazada mata sintata wana ampani ilimi. Wanda ea daga chikinsu Elizabeth Ndao teke che wa. Solution for lasting peace. Educate the leaders to be change makers in their communities. Samun zaman lafiya a doran kasa ya dogara ne ka tokam kan amfani da ilimi ta inda shugabanni ka iya amfani da shi domin samun salo a inganta rayuwar yau da kullum. Masana ilimi ba tun yau ba ke kallon nahiyar Afirka a matsayin wata tauraruwa abin misali a nan gaba a tsakanin kasashen